Welcome back to a new video. This was my Friday workout. I actually um, didn't really have any direct plan. I just kind of felt like squatting when I went in and that was kind of my only focus was to do back squats up to 225 or at least attempt it. I did do that 120 twice just for two singles just to keep warming up and I took normal jumps up to 170 and then after this was 205. Looking at these sets like I don't look like I move particular fast it's just interesting how they all just kind of move the same. Yeah, still pretty slow, but I decided I would uh, wing it and jump up to 225. I want to start normalizing this jump in my uh, squat training when I am working up on back squats because obviously it's 5 kilos heavier than the 220, but then it will allow me to start taking cracks if this 225 starts moving better at weights like 235 or 240 uh, potentially. Uh, the next logical jump would be 235 since I've done 232 relatively recently and doing 235 after a 225 would be a pretty logical 10 kilo jump so that's kind of the goal is just to kind of make those jumps feel easy I wasn't feeling particularly good or anything but after i did those back squats that which was not very much volume just pretty high intensity uh, i was actually feeling pretty decent for snatches i was like generally tired from them but uh, i just kept working up and this angle is actually pretty useful for seeing kind of the mechanics of my left arm and seeing that it's not so much a uh, like a strength or stability issue as much as it is my left arm just moving slow which I suppose could be chalked up to a strength and stability issue but it's kind of interesting to see how it's like just a little bit late compared to my right arm. My right arm kind of solid when I'm catching it and you start to notice it here where the press out is mostly just my arm just getting pushed back more, if that makes sense, kind of getting into that um, optimal position. So it just shows some of the things I need to work on when I'm working with lighter weights in here. This was the first 125 that I missed. Press it out real bad, but it was just the left arm just moving slow. Here it is again, where I pressed out, but I was able to stabilize it. Kind of ugly, but you know, it is what it is. I did that heavy snatch balance the day before, so I certainly wasn't fresh overhead, but I just need to get better at getting it back into the proper position uh, on a consistent basis, and that usually happens better with lighter weights and then less with heavier weights, so it's just something to practice more and more. I think doing things like the um, hang snatches, the hang power snatches and stuff will be really good uh, to work on that positioning and that kind of like extension into that aggressive finish. Uh, clean jerks, I was pleasantly surprised that these went um, as well as they did. I took big jumps uh, just because I was kind of tired at this point and if you feel pretty good on clean jerks or if you want to get it done fast it's usually going to take big jumps. This is 140 where it didn't actually feel too bad on the jerk I just was kind of felt weird on the balance but definitely felt confident to jump up to this 150 and I actually caught the clean pretty well. Got pitched forward a little bit but it moved up pretty fast on the squat up and this jerk was better than the 140. So pretty productive workout considering I started out the workout with a heavy back squat and was able to go heavy in the snatch and clean jerk after. Kind of just a big Friday but in uh, reverse I suppose uh, with the squat coming first but overall really good session. It just gives me more things to work on particularly in the snatch and just to continue to work on the things in the cleaner jerk. The extension or thinking about that on the clean has been really helpful. And with the jerk, it's really just committing to a full drive with pushing my knees out and stuff. So clean jerks are kind of in a neat, a nice groove. I just need to continue to work on snatches. But you know, anytime you hit 125, it's always a good day. So nothing to complain about. But that's it for now. Talk to you all in the next one. Peace.